you're the head superintendent here, right? Yes, sir. How long have you been here? Uh, it'll be three years in September. Three years? Yes. Okay. Yep. So what is, uh, what's the hardest part about preparing for something like this? This year it's been the weather. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the weather's been really tough on us the last couple of months. Um, you know, just Mother Nature's been the battle this year. Yeah. Would you say it's just the freezing, the, the wind? The freezing, the wind. Uh, so the month of July, I'm sorry, the month of January and February, we covered greens 24 times. Oh wow! And so, and we had a handful of cross delays as well. So it's been yeah. really cold. Yeah. How long have you been doing this uh, this sort of work? <clears throat> I've been uh, since 1996. Yeah. 1996. I've That's been with Club Corp for like, 17 years now. Okay. Always in Texas. Always in Texas. Started in Austin at Lakeway Golf Club, and then uh, went to Houston for a few years. I was at Deerwood Club in, in Kingwood. Very cool. And from there, I came here. Yeah, very cool. That's I, so I'm from Maryland originally, and I always talk about how much harder it is to chip around the greens here, and just how different Absolutely. the greens are, and Absolutely. all the grass types, and all that stuff. This zoysia is really tight. Yeah. So chipping, so as you see a bunch of guys putting it off of it, you know, it's, yeah. it's so much easier just to get the ball rolling. Yeah. Well, so. phenomenal job. Thank you, sir. Thanks for uh, taking some time to talk. With Absolutely. Us. Yeah. Hope sure. you guys are enjoying it. Yeah. Of course, man. So we're here with Reagan here at number 16 at Las Colinas Country Club. He's got a pendrometer. I don't know what that is, but I'm excited to find out. Yeah, so basically we're just checking firmness of all the greens, trying to get them, make sure they're consistent. Um, it's pretty simple. I'll explain it, just drop a ball from about six feet. And you just measure. You'll, uh, you'll notice these are pretty firm. So, which being high up too, Kind of drives them out a little bit. So just set it on there and push down a little bit. And just get you a number. So if it is too low or too high, I mean, what are the corrections that you're making? You just kind of do it two or three times just to make sure it's consistent. Um, so this one's pretty firm. We saw some shots today that looked like they were going to be good and ended up on the back of the green. So, like one, 145, 146. What's the sweet so, spot? What number are you looking for? Sweet spot's around 170. 170? 175. So. Okay, so that determines sort of the watering schedule? Uh, no, the not really. It's it? uh, more rolling, I guess. More rolling it? Yeah. Okay. You don't want one green faster than the other. Yeah. So that's not very consistent. And they're very particular on the tour, so. Yeah. It's, uh, it's not something we do every day, but it's something that the tour does. Yeah, so. Well, awesome, man. We appreciate your time. Yeah, no problem. For sure.